going to evaluate x tend to 0 1 minus cos 4x divided by 1 minus cos 5x so let's see the answer so first here writing the given limit x tend to 0 there 1 minus cos 4x divided by 1 minus cos 5x okay so here we need to use the formula 1 minus cos x that is equal to 2 sin square x by 2 and here 1 minus cos 2x that is equal to 2 sin square x like that if you use here 1 minus cos 3x that is equal to 2 sin square x by sorry 3x by 2 so each time that is divided by 2 now like that 1 minus cos 4x that is equal to 2 sin square 2x and here 1 minus cos 5x that is equal to 2 sin a square 5x by 2 ok so when x then x by 2 when 2x then x 3x 3x by 2 4x then 2x 5x then 5x by 2 6x then uh, 3x ok so let's use that limit x tend to 0 1 minus cos 4x that is equal to 2 sin square 2x ok and thereafter 1 minus cos 5x we can write 2 sin square 5x by 2 so this 2 to 2 that cancel thereafter we can write limit x tend to 0 here sin 2x whole square divided by sin 5x by 2 whole square after that we can write limit x tend to 0 so this we can write here or uh, sin 2x so this is uh, or 2x is there so in denominator multiply 2x whole square and numerator 2x whole square after that here you can see 1 by sin 5x by 2 whole square so we need here this place 5x by 2 whole square so there we need to multiply 5x by 2 whole square okay so now thereafter we can try it limit x tend to 0 this here we can write sin 2x by 2x whole square and this here 4x square and now we can write sin 5x by 2 divided by 5x by 2 both power 2 and the next is here 1 by so 5x square that is 25x square and 2 that is 4 after that we know the formula call limit x tend to 0 sin x by x that is equal to 1 so they are 2x by 2x so when x tend to 0 obviously 2x also tend to 0 so x to move on the right so 0 by 2 that is equal to 0 so this return here 1 whole is 1 square and this here 4x square this return 1 so 5x by x tend to 0 5x by 2 also tend to 0 so this return 1 square and this here 4 that move up and 25x square x square x square that cancel ok or 5 now the next is here 4 into 4 16 and this is here 25 so I think this is our final answer of this limit so one time going to repeat so this formula that is essential for to solve this problem when cos 1 minus cos x that is 2 sin square x by 2 so this 2 that is required use that after that you can get this terms so we need to here 2 rex in the denominator so write 2x whole square multiply in numerator 2x whole square 1 by sin 5x by 2 whole square 5x by 2 whole square 5x by 2 multiply there 
After that, this here sin 2x by 2 whole square and 2x 4x square this here right and this or 25x square by 4 this form move on up and here you can this well this return 1 this return 1 and after doing the calculation there you can get 16 by 25 so this is the way we can find evaluate limit x tend to 0 1 minus cos 4x divided by 1 minus cos 5x so I hope guys this video is the helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.